Dan Perkins, Jasper County Cover Crop Guy. We are in a field April 8th. We just took video of this annual ryegrass strip. And we have down here 24 inches. And what I wanted to highlight is glomulin. What is this notion of glomulin? This is the Elmer's glue of the soil. And when you have a root like this, that's this is sand, right? Which is really difficult to hold on to. Doesn't, you know, we'd say it's hard to build organic matter. Um, well, as you can see this root, I can shake this root and it's actually hanging onto grain particles. And that's a sign of glomulin, of those root exudates hanging onto that soil and building our soil tilth. You know, up here, we have a lot of root mass hanging onto this soil here. And that's what we want. You know, that's building it up here. But we can get the same thing down, you know, 29 inches to 33 inches if we continue to provide the living roots to create this glomulin, to create the mycorrhizae relationships that extend our roots, so our cash crop roots extend that out nine to 10 times further than the average root length. So this is about nutrient extension, nutrient availability, water availability, availability, even in these sandy soils. And we see the same thing in clay soils too. So again, the power of glomulin demonstrated 29 plus inches down. Dan Perkins, cover crop guy, Jasper County, Indiana.